Today we're going to be taking a look at the best custom fit vehicle wiring harness for your 2016 Jeep Compass. Here we have the two best custom fit vehicle wiring harnesses for your Jeep Compass. Here on your left we have the Concha, part number 118539. And here on your right we're going to have the Kurt, part number C56344. Let's go over some of the differences between these two. One of the big noticeable differences we're going to see here is going to be the size of our converter box. You can see our Kurt box is a little bit bigger which means it may be a little bit more difficult or you may be limited on certain places that you can place this one. Where your Takancha, it looks pretty small, so you can just about fit that one anywhere. Another difference is going to be how our wires run up to our plugs. On our Kurt, it goes from a single wire, it splits to a double. Where that connection is made is just covered by some heat shrink. Where on our Takancha, our wires run up into our plug, the wires come out of our plug over to the other side. Now as far as amperage goes, your Kurt's going to have 3 amps per circuit for your stop and turn and 6 amps per circuit for your tail lights, where your Takancha is going to have 4.2 amps per circuit for your stop and turn and 7.5 amps for your tail lights. Now let's go over some of the similarities. One, let's go back over our boxes again. These are converter boxes. What these are going to do, these are going to protect your factory wiring in your vehicle from back feed from the trailer if the trailer has a wiring issue. Another thing, both these are going to install exactly the same. They're going to plug directly into your factory wiring right behind your taillights and the other one's going to go into your taillight itself. Both are going to have a power wire that's going to run up to your battery and you're also going to have a ground that you're going to ground somewhere to the body of the vehicle. Both are going to come with insulation kits, butt connectors, your uh, fuse holders, and then your power wire that's going to run up to the front to the battery. One of the positive things with both of these wiring kits is the potting material that's inside. Your converter box, your wires come in and they connect to a circuit board. This material right here, what it does is it fills a hole inside of this box and it holds those wires onto that circuit board really well. So if for some reason this box happens to come loose after it's mounted and it starts moving around, those wires are gonna be well protected inside there. This potting material is gonna hold them in place really well, keep them from coming off. Both these wiring harnesses are also gonna give you the four pole connection so you get all the proper lighting functions to safely tow your trailer. In summary, as far as ease of insulation, the Deconcha is going to have a slight advantage because of the size of the converter box alone. As far as durability, again, Deconcha is going to have a slight advantage over the Kurt because of the way the wires are connected. Kurt, the connection is made under heat shrink, where on your Deconcha, the wires run up into the plug. As far as my personal opinion, I'm going to have to go with Deconcha for the durability factor alone. And that'll do it for a look at the best custom fit vehicle wiring for your Jeep Compass.